Well, no longer will you see Chattanooga parking enforcement workers writing citations to drivers who park illegally. In a few weeks, CARTA is taking over, hiring a new set of people to enforce the rules. News Channel 9's Jerry Askin is here now with a breakdown of some of the new parking regulations and reaction from drivers. Jerry. Well, Kim and Latricia, the good news, there are no changes to parking fees or hours at parking meters. But now, CARTA is working with Republic Parking to enforce the regulations. They're hoping the new company will help improve parking and increase revenue downtown. Parking. It's frustrating for many drivers downtown. But I don't like the fact that people who work downtown hog the spaces. A lot of it's reserved. A lot of it you got to pay five bucks or more to get to. The fee is a little bit exceeding. You know what I'm saying? Effective October 22nd, drivers will see a group of 10 workers in green shirts known as ambassadors. You'll find them walking downtown enforcing parking. Carter will pay Republic Parking $25,000 per year for at least five five years to enforce parking. The ambassadors will be fully trained and able to do more than just write tickets. They've been through training with the Convention and Visitors Bureau on hospitality training. We've instructed them where possible to pick up trash, basically be good citizens as well as doing their job of enforcement. CARTA expects to make $480,000 per year from parking citations. For the first two years, they plan to give the city all the funds. The third year, they plan to give the city half and keep the other half to make parking improvements. Like their current plan to add more than 600 new parking meters downtown by the end of this year, many of which will take credit cards. And CARTA will also be enforcing regulations against drivers who park illegally, like this vehicle you see parked here. CARTA officials say they're still working to find new and creative ways to improve parking and make it more convenient for drivers. For now, they're urging drivers who will park more than two hours to park in lots and garages. They're also cracking down on drivers who get multiple tickets, something Annette Evans is all for. That's a great idea because uh, when you got the first one, you didn't pay attention. You got the second one, you didn't pay attention. At the third time, I mean, no other place gives you that many opportunities. And drivers will have 10 days to pay their citation before fees increase. The current policy gives drivers seven days to pay. They're also adding a parking store near Shuttle Park South for drivers to pay tickets and appeal citations. As for the current parking enforcement officers, Tom Dugan says they'll be used in other ways at the police station. Kim. Jerry, thank you very much.